Welcome to episode 7. As you can see, we've done some careful calculations, taken some measurements, killed some time, and we've come to a conclusion for the best course of action for the motorhome. Now, let's take a look, we'll see where we're at. Doesn't look great, I'll admit, but it's not that bad. It's not that bad. It's not too bad. It doesn't smell a damp or anything in here. It's not that bad. It's really not that bad. Hello, darkness, my old friend. It's not that bad. <laughs> so yeah, it was pretty rotten. Everything we found was rotten. All the all the Brain was rotten, the wood was rotten, everything. And like, it was all just flexing and bowing, so it's gone. But luckily we found a good chassis. The chassis is in really good condition. Immaculate. New frame, bit of wood, some sheeting, should be grand. There's just a lot of footage of us pulling this apart. Stuff's been recorded in all in different orders, so I don't actually know how this video is gonna turn out, but Hopefully, you'll enjoy it. Plastic. That is recording. Where do you want it? I don't know, pointing at stuff that's happening. Oh, that moved a lot. <laughs> <laughs> that's pointing at <laughs> all, Kyle. It's wide open lens. <laughs> oh, that's better. Turn it more towards you. That'll do. Right. Hopefully, it's, that's getting what that we want. Well on the. But yeah, but. Beery. That had a bleep in there. <laughs> <laughs> I may lose the commission. Oh, was that trace? You'll need you'll need a bleep in there. He <laughs> 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 has said that a lot. He has. I mean, uh, to be fair, last time I was a bit upset. He didn't bleep. He used a duck noise. We have some flex. It's <laughs> <That was> good. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's hard work, this is. Wasn't that was a sign? Yeah, sign. It's time for a cup of coffee. <laughs> Do Jesus Christ. I feel like I'm going to snap this whole front off. 
Just lift that again. The whole lot. The whole <laughs> lot is moving. Which we'd expect considering we've taken a lot of it apart and it's got very little strength left. But I think now it's becoming a bit more of a reality for Dane. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It's escalating. I think that's going to be the name of it. Maybe the snowball. Maybe we'll call it snowball. <laughs> <laughs> Avalanche. <laughs> Jesus. It's taking quite a lot of effort just to remove these grub bags. Oh, all of the effort. And there everywhere so the front has been some sort of botched repair to the front and it was just sealed up with like carpet trim and electrical capping and wood screws all that kind of good stuff some really crappy sealing and bonding yeah it's good it looks like there was windows behind here originally so i'm guessing they've been damaged and leaking or whatever so they've just really nicely installed this this new front on it it's fine it's horrible under it we'll carry on oh. it's not this is to stand there that's show that that's not been shown yet guys <laughs> so these are the original vents or what's left of the original vents <laughs> Just so much of it. Yeah. It doesn't need to be that much tiger sitting. Oh, top, middle and bottom. It definitely didn't want this coming off. I just don't want to pull it and then it pops and then I'll go flying off the ladder. There's <laughs> the original compass clipper sticker behind it. Oh, I'll have to have a break from this. <laughs> it's killing me.
gently does it. Steady, steady. Wah! Steady. Nothing's new. It's a new noise, though. Good. Oh. 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 Ah! Don't watch the end of the
And there you go. Hopefully that wasn't too boring to watch. Uh, just have a quick look again at the chassis. It is really good, like surprisingly good considering how the rest of it was. I did lose some footage. I've got to get this like SD card GoPro thing figured out because I keep losing stuff. Footage of us lifting the floor up. I lost a lot of that, so there's only a little clip of it in there. You see the running gears out as well. I was going to put all that in this one video, but it started getting a bit long. So I'm doing another video, which is probably going to be a little bit short, but you know, a bit more content. I've not put anything out for a while, so hopefully that will make up for that. We're getting there. We should start tearing the LT apart soon and looking at putting the running gear in this. So stick with us. Hopefully it's about to start getting a bit more interesting uh, on, can't even call it a motor home anymore. It's just a chassis cab. It's a clean chassis cab though, <laughs> it's solid. But yeah, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share it, show your mates. We'll see you next time.